<laughs> Hi there, welcome everybody. Welcome to our virtual early on the, uh, the Black History Month edition. Um, so this virtual early on is gonna be a little bit different from what we normally do with uh, circle time and with the songs and the stories. We're still doing songs and stories, but we're also gonna be introducing some slides that are gonna talk about Black History Month. And hopefully we'll share something that uh, is new to you or, or you know, feel, help you feel better about Black History Month. So here we go. So I'm Christian Morgan, I forgot to introduce myself and I'm a family support worker at the Parkdale High Park early on. And um, my name is Glenda Diaz. I'm also a family support worker at the same center. I am Monisa Shrasta, a student from Ryerson University. I'm doing my internship at the center right now. And hi everyone, my name is Diane Whitley. I'm the office administrator and I also work at the same center as everybody else. Oh yeah, I guess I'm switching the pages. <laughs> <laughs> so what is Black History Month? So it is celebrated in the month of February and Black History Month is a time to celebrate and remember all the ways that Black Canadians have contributed to Canada's history and culture. It provides an opportunity to learn about African cultures. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna start with, are you ready? Um, so we're gonna do the actions. So with this one, we're gonna do uh, some clapping and then um, we do, let me see. And then we shake our fingers and then we're gonna put them on our nose. And really this is a great song. You could get the kids to pick wherever they like to put their fingers on their head, on their shoulders. But for this one, we're gonna do on your nose. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let me see, let me see. Shake your fingers like this. Shake your fingers like this. Put them on your nose. Put them on your nose. <laughs> Yay. All right, and we're um, gonna keep things going. Tickety boo, just like a train. I got, I've got my train whistle. And like all, all, all our songs are gonna be songs you've heard before. It's, uh, <laughs> that's not the special part, <laughs> although it, it is pretty special. So we're gonna start off, at, or I guess the next song is gonna be the Good Morning Train. Um, so I'm going to start by pretending I'm a train, right? So we'll get my arms going like this. And, uh, uh well, first we're going to take a great big deep breath in actually. So here we go. Ready? <gasps> and then let out all that steam. And then we're going to start on the track, starting slow. Chugga, chugga, chugga. <laughs> the good morning train is coming. How are you? The good morning train is coming. How are you? The good morning train is coming. The good morning train is coming. The good morning train is coming. How are you? And we say hello to Glenda. How are you? And we say hello to Christian. How are you? And we say hello to Manisha. And we say hello to Diane. And we say hello to everyone. How are you? Hello, everyone. <laughs> awesome. So the next facts um, talk a little bit more about Black History Month. So Black history refers to the stories, experiences, and accomplishments of people of African origin. Black history did not begin in recent times in Canada, but in ancient times in Africa. People connected by their common African history and ancestry have created Black history here in Canada. The African Canadian population is made up of people from a range of places across the world, including the US, South America, the Caribbean, Europe, Africa, and Canada. Absolutely. So let's do the song Roly Poly. Are you ready? Roly Poly, Roly Poly, up, 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 up. Roly Roly Poly, Roly Roly Poly, down, 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 down. 
Roly poly, roly poly, out, 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 out. Roly, roly poly, roly, roly poly, in, 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 in. Roly poly, roly poly, fast, 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 fast. Roly, roly poly, roly, roly poly. Slow, 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 slow. Roly poly, roly poly. Loud, 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 loud. Roly, roly poly, roly, roly poly. Soft, 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 soft. Hey. Thank you. <laughs> <Nice>. <laughs> Okay, so the first Black person in Canada was in January 1st, 1608, and the first Black person thought to have set foot on Canadian soil was Matthew da Costa, a free man who was hired by Europeans to act as a translator. Can you believe how long ago that was? So long. Three years ago, yeah. <laughs> so that's like four centuries, right? Like, and we got another train song. <laughs> so uh, I don't know why we ended up doing I, that was me I chose all the train songs but <laughs> I, I didn't I wasn't aware of doing that when I did it <laughs> anyway this is down by the station it's lots of fun so it goes down by the station early in the morning see the little puffer billies all in a row see the engine driver Pulling on their lever, puff, puff, <laughs> off they go. You know, I just wanted an excuse to use a train whistle. <laughs> oh, but we, I do it we again. We found it's out short. the truth. Yeah. Yeah, that's all. That's all it is. I'm just like, oh, I got this train whistle. Want to use it again and again? All right, so we'll do it one more time. One more time, just because. Down by the station, early in the morning. See the little puffer billies all in a row. See the engine driver pulling on their lever. Puff, puff, <laughs> off they go. <laughs> awesome. So now we're going to take a look. Uh, this is a one famous Black Canadian and uh, Viola Davis Desmond. She, you can see her on, or you can see her picture on her $10 bills. And she's known for just wanting to go to the movie theater uh, with everybody else and to feel welcomed. So that's one of the things that she is known for. And she's pretty famous for standing up for everybody being treated respectfully and equally. Mm -hmm. Very brave person. And I guess we'll sing another song, one more song. Um, if all the raindrops, so uh, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna be opening our mouths really, really wide for this, right? So like ah, and it goes like this: If all the raindrops were lemon drops and gum drops, oh what a rain that would be! Standing outside with our mouths open wide, say ah 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 ah. Ah, 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 ah. If all the raindrops were lemon drops and gum drops, oh, what a rain that would be. Yum, yum. One more time, right? One more time. We got to do these things twice. <laughs> Just to make sure you get your good fill of lemon drops and gum drops, right? So if all the rain drops were lemon drops and gum drops, oh, what a rain that would be. Standing outside with our mouths open wide, saying, ah, 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 ah. <laughs> If all the rain drops were lemon drops and gum drops, oh, what a rain that would be. Yum, yum. Mm, mm, mm. I don't know if you can see, I'm rubbing my belly. <laughs> Probably not. You can't tell. All right. 
Okay, here are some lessons for our younger children. Younger children may not be ready for all the details of Black history, but they can understand the core message that every person should be treated the same and with kindness and respect. As adults, we should be talking about the need to have a world where all people are treated with kindness and respect. Have conversation, research together, not everyone knows everything, learn together. I guess this is more a lesson for the, the parents and adults, <laughs> actually. Mm -hmm. It's just how to continue having a conversation about Black History Month and about respect and equality. Absolutely. And, we're, and we're, so we're gonna continue on though with, uh, with our learning because mm -hmm. we have three books, right? It's, uh, mm -hmm. So the so first I book that it, we're gonna read is I Look Up to Michelle Obama. And this book is by Anna Membrino and Fatih Burke. Mm -hmm. I look up to Michelle Obama. Let me tell you why. Michelle works hard, day and night. She knows that working hard makes learning interesting and fun. She says, I never cut class, which means she always goes to school. I loved getting A's. I liked being smart. I liked being on time. I thought being smart is cooler than anything in the world. Michelle cares about being healthy. She loves to exercise and eat fruit and vegetables from the garden. She says, when you give your body the best possible fuel, you have more energy you're stronger, and you think more quickly. Michelle knows how to have fun. She likes to be silly. People feel comfortable around her because she is comfortable around them. She says, my view is first you get them to laugh, and then you get them to listen. Michelle believes in education. Michelle is smart and knows she can share her ideas clearly because she had a good education. She says, for me, education was power. I can be like Michelle and so can you. And for my friends who don't know who Michelle Obama is, she was married to the first black president of the United States. Her husband's name is Barack Obama. She's the first black first lady. Yes. Okay, our next book, I'm gonna read it. It's called um, Baby Dance. And this is kind of a, a movement book, right? But I'm just gonna sit here and read it. <laughs> <laughs> Hush, little baby, don't you cry. Hush, little baby, mama's nearby. Dance, little baby, move to and fro. Coo and crow, baby, there you go. Oh. Up to the ceiling, down to the ground. Back. Word, forward, round and round. Dance, little baby, dance and sing. Dance along, sing along, ring a ding ding. Oh, it's short. Short but sweet. Short but sweet. And the next book, the last book we're going to be reading is called Shades of Black, a celebration of our children, written by Sandra L. Pickney. I am Black. I am unique. I am the creamy white frost in a vanilla ice cream and the milky smooth brown in a chocolate bar. I am the midnight blue in a licorice stick and the golden brown in sugar. I am the velvety orange in a peach and the coppery brown in a pretzel. 
I am the radiant brassy yellow in popcorn and the gingery brown in a cookie. I am black, I am unique. My hair is the soft puffs in a cotton ball and the stiff ringlets in lamb's wool. My hair is straight edge and a blade of grass and a twisted corkscrew in a rope. My hair is short and my hair is long. All of my hair is good. I am black, I am unique. My eyes are the delicate streaks of amber in a tiger's eye and the warm luster of green in a unikit. My eyes are the brilliant flash of blue in a lipis and the shimmering glow of ebony in an onyx. I am black, I am unique. I come from the ancient kings and queens. When you look at me, what do you see? I am black, I am proud to be me. Hey. <laughs> wow. Well, that's it. That's, that's, that's everything. Thank you so much, everybody. And, and thank you for joining us for our special Black History Month virtual early on session. We'll see you next time. Bye. 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 Bye.